guys, today I'm going to be building a scarlet and violet binder. Let's go! I am going to be using this Dollar Tree binder. Yes, I know, I used that for Silver Tempest. I know I have to start somewhere, but I wasn't getting anywhere with that. I'm eventually going to do it again with Silver Tempest, but I had barely any, so we're going to do Scarlet and Violet instead. So, uh, Scarlet Violet, as a lot of you probably know, is the newest, there we go, one, is the newest set that has been released, so, uh, yeah, and I don't know if a lot of you guys know, but this August, August 11th to be exact, the new Scarlet Violet set, uh, is coming out, it's called Obsidian Flames. I might do a pre-release thing of it, I don't know. Soon I'm gonna be doing, uh, what is it called? Uh, Lost Origin? Yeah, Lost Origin. Uh, there's one for Lost Origin. Uh, Lost Origin Binder, so. Make sure to subscribe so you can get notified when that comes out. I have a bunch, and these are all my extra cards, so this is going to take a little bit longer. You know what, I'm going to go ahead and time lapse this. We have the binder, this will be a little bit quicker, but I'll still time lapse it. We have all them, we're going to start sorting them out. There you go, so let's go start putting them in the binder. Before we do that, Let's just get the disappointing part out of the way. As you might have seen, the Van Gogh videos, I will, if you haven't, you should check them out. The Van Gogh videos, I was in Las Vegas, just got back yesterday, and we, and I'm going to not open any packs right now, or not after I do this. I'm actually going to tell you what I recommend, what I don't recommend to do in Vegas and what I got. Yes, it's a disappointment, I know. I didn't get any packs, so we will when we do the Lost Origin Binder, I promise. But let's get back to your video. There you go. There, here is my scarlet and violet binder. There is one thing that we're missing though. I've never showed it to you. I don't, if you've watched my uh, twelve dollars shopping spree that I did, I you should go watch it. I talked about. I pulled this. I pulled this out of one pack. One pack. I pulled this, and that will go. It's at 225, so let's see here. Mm, this was gonna take some math, so let's skip. Okay, this is gonna go right here at the very end. Come on. Saved the most stubborn for last. Out, Gyarados EX is now a part. Okay, there you go. But wait, stay tuned. I'm going to have to go check something really quick. Just as I su suspected. I forgot to put this in it. I must have missed it somewhere. But this is going to be going right. Staraptor is going to be going right here. Okay. There we go. That is my whole entire binder. Or for Scarlet Violet. We are, yet, we are as I said, I'll say it again. We're soon going to be doing a Lost Origin binder. I just need to buy a new binder so yep stay tuned though because i'm gonna i'm gonna be talking about the las vegas and what to do and do, what to not to do and i will do some pokemon terms i promise okay okay 
So, what to do and what not to do in Vegas, or what, it, what I would say. And, yeah. Okay. So, I'll start with what to do. I, one of my favorite things is the Marvel Station. I will put a little clip or something on it right here. And so the Marvel Station, it, it has like a bunch of movie, from the movie props. Very end, you can play a game. It's, it's a fun game. Uh, and so yeah, we have, there's a really fun thing. You can do, like there's this Hulk thing you can press and it do, the Hulk does some action. And yeah, you walk in at the gift shop and I would say at the gift shop, I didn't get anything there because one, because I like collecting Funko Pops and all they had was Infinity Killmonger, which I didn't want. Um, and two, because uh, it was pretty expensive. There was this land, the cheapest thing there I think was this lanyard, Black Panther lanyard that was $6. And so yeah, I, I would recommend go there though. And ne next, Let's do Van Gogh. If you, if you haven't seen my videos, I'm not, I'm just going to say it's immersive. That's all I'm going to say. Go watch my videos, and you'll see it is really cool. Then there's the Coca-Cola store, which I highly recommend going to. Um, the gift shop there is really cool. I got this little uh, this bear I really like. Funko Pop, and so, yeah, it and it's reasonable. I, this usually would go for about twenty dollars. I got it there for fifteen, so I would highly recommend going to there. Um, the M and M World. It's cool there. I will say. Um, I and yeah, so it's really cool there, but. If you want to get M&M's, you're better off just buying regular M&M's. Yes, they have some cool flavors like mint and peanut butter. You can buy peanut butter M&M's anywhere, but like mint and that stuff. But, and there's, you can customize your own, which is cool. But it's $22 for one little bag. And if you, when you fill up your own with them, it's $9 for a half a pound. So, if you want to pay those prices for M&M's, you can't, that might be for you if you really like M&M's, but I wouldn't say, it's cool there, I wouldn't say to buy M&M's. I say you're better off buying M&M's just at a normal store, but yeah. Then what else is there? Hmm. There's a, a the Caesar's Palace. It has a lot. There's... Uh, it has a lot of cool things there. I'll just say that. There's, if, if, okay, if you're watching this right from the Pokemon part, if you didn't just skip through it, thank you for watching the whole video, but, um, the, there is an arcade in New York, New York, and one of the games that you can, it's this, it's kind of like a claw machine. It's called, it's like a lock thing. You can win Pokemon cards. And there's a lot of Pokemon claw machines there. And yeah. So that that's my opinion about Las Vegas. Hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for next week when I do the Lost Origin binder. And yes, I will do vi I will do open packs instead of doing this. Because this is, I know, boring. Um, but yeah. Uh, so watch the Van Gogh videos. Stay tuned. So please like and subscribe if you like this. And then hit that bell notifications for when my new videos come out. Okay, bye.